All right, and back. It's time to actually build factory, right? Not really. It's going to be another fix-it day. Um, I updated. Internal burner, change and upgrade. Oh, I should probably pay attention to that. Also, I looked up the problem with respecking out of um uh the other two the the data the creature printer the creature chamber upgrade i still can't reverse it just because i don't have a reverse i used to have them but they were time bounded which is really unfortunate so what was it fastwood forestry yeah see time bounded so what do we got What's our choices here? We have much more efficient raw fiber, and I mean much more efficient. And we can have just a ton more wood. Like this is really good. This is really, really quite good. <laughs> it's just much better. <laughs> it's faster. Oh, it's much faster, and it's much better. Everything about this is amazing. We have an internal burner. Oh, and this gives us 50% productivity on fast wood forestries, right? Yeah. So, 50% productivity is pretty cool. And it does... What is the... What's the difference here? Oh, it takes more ash. It requires more ash for more logs. It's an internal burner. The burner will generate part of the electricity consumed by building. These hungry trees will need more ash to grow. But I don't use ash anywhere. So this is just like a free 50% productivity. But right here we have 100% productivity. <laughs> you know? I... Real speed, 50%. And productivity is up 50%. So, this is weird. This is very strange. I'm not sure if I can get behind this. It's like, this is just very straightforward. Hey, your logs, you get double for your logs. Whereas this is, you get more logs. And faster logs here. Let's take a, take a look. So, they're probably roughly equivalent, right? I mean, basically the same thing. So, the speed here is two and a half times crafting speed. So this happens in like, um, like seven seconds. So it's like one wood is log a second. Yeah, that's what it says, 1. 1. 1.3 logs a second. And it does it comes with productivity so every other one is double I alright this is fine I'm happy with this and wastewater is probably doing okay right all right we're just gonna leave that for right now um we're just gonna look at the most important parts of the factory right now then we're gonna probably fix circuits all right this is humming Everyone's going, right? Except you're not going. I have a problem with this just yesterday. Why are you not going? Oh, because we're completely full up here, right? Yeah, that makes sense. It doesn't want to make anymore. It feels it's done. And frankly, it's correct. And then... I should look into making next-gen muck moose. Um... Yeah, that'll help, especially if I want to continue to buff artillery, and I really do. I really, really do. So this is going... Oh, I know what I want to do. Uh, I have been kind of just watching this out of the corner of my eye, and I believe I need another dinosaur on Relesia runs. That we are now consuming... This is probably wrong, right? Whenever they're both flashing. It's like there should be mutual underflows is what we're doing here. Less than... 
50. And that's the same thing. So neither of these should be going because we're both fine. But that should be bi-directional. Mutual underflowing. That's the paradigm we want. Um, but over here in Moo Land, what I need that's far away. Anyway, I need a dinosaur. And I learned you can do this just the other day. Copy. Paste. Did that work? It did. It worked. We copied and pasted that dinosaur. Nice. Now just go on an adventure, please. Now we have three dinosaurs right here, which hopefully will now throw production back on um, mushrooms whenever it happens. What do I need to do to make Mukmoos 2? I should really look into that, right? Better moos. Oh, the speed is only half again as much. Hmm. Huh. So we need water, Mukmoo food, Mukmoos. It's exactly the same as everything else. Yeah, only it takes two muck moves and only has a chance to make it, give you a muck move back. So that's unfortunate, right? Shouldn't you? Didn't you have to print these? Two muck moves too, and yeah, and then you print them, and you get three muck moves too, and then you have to get all sorts of expensive stuff, including the the codex. You need Mukmu integrated module. That's a neural processor. Hey, I got those now. This is only to replicate them, and I don't need that many. So maybe I can make those by hand. Like, I only need them really for the uh, reproductive centers. The other places are doing just fine. So maybe I do this. Maybe I need to hit two of these. I can at least start, right? I have all the stuff I need right here. All I have to do is throw down a reproductive center. Um, like right here. Do I have any at Seaweed Isle? I usually do. Any reproductive centers? Yeah. Okay, let's go do this. Let's just, you know do this. This needs actual moves though, input, so I guess where I was doing this before was incorrect. This will give us something to look forward to, and we'll directly contribute to uh, the well-being of the factory. Because moves produce a lot of what we need in order to reach out and touch our neighbors, and we like our neighbors. We like to keep them very close. So I guess the best place to put this monster would be right here. Only it interferes with so much stuff, so no, can't. So we have a moo line right here that we have to pay attention to. The moos come out, so I guess right here, I suppose. This is absolutely not out of the question. These old cliffs lasted for so long, but none can resist the coming of the moos. Okay, we'll do a nice professional line. Oh, this is an ancient part of the factory. This used to be where I, uh, I had, um, steel making and the old version, this is like the old secondary mine way back and way in the day. <laughs> We're going to leave this monument right here. Take a lot more ash than you used to, right? 60 ash? That's highly questionable. Well, you're not going, and you probably never will again, so. <laughs> uh, I suppose it's sad in its own way. It's over here. There we go. Now we throw down a reproductive center. Well, that's terrible, isn't it? I suppose we have to now move these. Oh. 
All right, we'll do it right. Reproductive center, worst building in the game. Easy, easily worst building in the game. I want you to do Mukmu part two. All right. To do this, uh, you need moos. That's unfortunate. How long do you take to do this? I'm going to grab me some moves. Luckily, I have the strategic moo reserve right here. Okay, bang, bang. You go in there. And how long do you take to do this? 30 seconds. Crafting speed is 200 right now, so it's going to take 15 seconds. It says... You need fast inserters for this. Maybe not. Just normal inserters, but we have infrastructure on the walkway, which is not how you want to live your life. We will set this up. Again, this is all for artillery in the end. It's all because I like to shoot up the uh, shoot off the big guns. See, we're short on religious seeds right now. And then... And one more. Then we need to get two level two moves. And then this can go away. And then we, we build them by... Do uh... we have salt coming in anywhere? No. Salt only comes in up there. Oh, that's unfortunate. And to get the salt, we'll have to... It's not quite a war crime, but it's been considered. Alright, so there you go. Do is this, and this this. Alright, so just all output just in this box. And we will gamble for moves. Oh, we need another uh, barreling facility, don't we? Right here. So, please make me empty barrel. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, we didn't need nearly that many. And then I want you to take out blacklist uh, barrel. Yeah. Then I want you to bump, bump, bump. I want you to do the opposite of that. I want you to whitelist barrel. Alright, so here you go, have some barrels. Yep, two, three, four. Alright, so good, right? So what are we going to run out of first here? Like obviously, okay, are we going to hit it? Are we going to hit it right off the bat? This is going to be another Arquad situation. And then once this is done, it gets harder because I have to um, then generate them. And no winner. No nothing. We just destroyed moves. You gotta spend moves to make moves. Alright, so this is now running. It's a long term investment in the health of the factory. Um, and I'm happy about it, right? Happy's the word for what I am right now. And then, better moves with the next level reproductive factory. Uh, made a moo. That's now what we want. Okay, so better moves will move this, move this to even faster speeds, and they'll make more calves. And that'll get the next level 
uh, reproductive center, and that will make even more faster calves. And the goal will be to have all of these going all the time. Like, I'm just fine with them being raised at this speed with this tech. I just need more calves. It's like probably getting extra moves in will light these two up and all these eight will be going and then the extra reproductive center will be more than enough to do all of this so this is probably the least efficient way to do it but i mean then i can always consider putting more in this this is space for more but then we'll have to talk about red belts i think which is a healthy conversation to have Kind of stressed that we don't have uh, dinosaurs constantly waiting. Well, check it out. All right, we did something good. Um, let's go and now mess with red circuits and see if I can get that working. Oh, it's going to be so hard not to just go back and look. We got the gambles again. Oh, nothing. Nothing. Ah, uh, five products finished. We haven't hit yet. It's wrong. Why aren't we getting lucky? Why? Why is it so unlucky? But we'll get... Red circuits are almost certainly down because we have no optical cable. Optical cable is down because photopore is all messed up at the moment. Photopore is messed up because they now rot and they used to not rot. And that makes us very sad. I wonder why this is all stopped. Actually, I can just ask that question. Oh, this is full up. That's nice. Here, just keep going, my friends. Don't stop. Continue doing this. All these parts might get used, might not get used. I don't know. What's your problem? Why are you not going? You need... Bakelite. Bakelite needs phenol. Phenol is... Oh, you need to be split. And phenol is not going well because we can't get rid of the acetone. Which is... Where we were last time, right? Now we're still here. So that's good. Um... What else needs to be going? So that's better... What are we doing here? Gearbox. Makes me more gearboxes. I don't want to open this. Well, maybe I'll open this up a little more. Um, maybe that was a mistake. Yeah, I don't know. Um, oh, and here. It's the other one. Oh, why is brakes now going well? Are you stuck? It's waiting for the signal to drop. Huh. This is a, a weird old style one. Output signal is T equals 1. Oh, how did I do this? So, on red line, we have T equals 1. T is less than 6. Output G equals 1. This is comparative equals 1. Where are you stuck? You're stuck on giving cellulose because cellulose rotted out. Alright, this needs to be fixed because um, cellulose needs to be made on site now. So, this just stops. Um, yeah, give me that biomass. And we just have to stick a pin in this. We have to make cellulose around here. That's really unfortunate. Or move this, which is probably more reasonable, right? Oh, you need cellulose. Oh, man. Cellulose is not easy to make. Well, it's just wood and wood and limestone or raw fiber. And so, so what? Okay, never mind. I'm just mumbling, moaning to myself here. Cellulose is actually pretty easy to make. It just has to be made right here 
on site. A lot of it too, right in here. All right. Um, fix it now or put it on the list? I guess we fix it now. We need high pressure furnaces for this, right? We need another one. Go get more small parts, I think. Yeah. All right, so what are we doing? It's cellulose. So what we need is another dinosaur, in other words. To go get wood and to go get... Oh, maybe it wasn't the high pressure furnace. It's this. It's... We gotta research this, don't we? It's like a real good idea. Uh, go get wood, go get sodium hydroxide, and it's in a biofact. Go get two of these. Duralumin and a whole lot of iron. Alright, we will fix this instead of fixing the other thing. And then, once we have fixed this, we will have earned the right to go look at the gambling thing again. See if we can gamble. See if it's worked out. It's gonna hit. I know it's gonna hit. Ah, uh, biofact. Give me two. And this is gonna be really rough because it needs so much. Like this is the limiting step right here. The creation of uh, cellulose. So we want a caravan, of course. This is all we can fit here, so hope you're happy. You want to make cellulose. Um, yeah. Yeah. Then what we need... just exactly like that and then we want a new new style caravan right and your job is um we want two things we want wood and we want sodium hydroxide hydroxide all right right there Less than 100, less than 100. That's your job. Right. Just to pick you up. Yes, yes, you are. Comparator equals go. Oh, but the problem with this is. Uh, wires are on the wrong side. Good thing it's intelligent enough that I can just move them. So this has to be down one. Good. Straight up. Alright, so. What we need now is how fast do you make this stuff? 0.14, so less than one a second. Like, if I speed module this right here, now we have exactly one a second, essentially. Um, so this will only go once every 30, so that's fine, that's fine. Um, all right, so that's okay. Speed moduling this is fine. Um, oh, I need to get a whole bunch of hands. All right, let's go do that. Then we will continue fixing factory. Fixing, fixing, fixing factory. It's fixing factory day. The day where we fix factory. And then hopefully tomorrow we'll be able to go throw some balls around. Oh, are we out of PySci 2? That's not what I want to see. Okay, what else do I need? I think that's it. Yeah, PySci 2 is out. We have all the chem science we could ever need. 
Yeah, science is falling. Science is failing us. You are wrong to believe in science. You must go back to the worship of Chur. This was the right way. We have been fooled. All right, so what's going on with Pi Psi 2? So three of you is going, but you're not going because you need Sarkoris. What do we see here? We see... So this just needs to be governed a little lower, right? So let's go with 11 instead of 9. Let's go with 13 instead of 9. Wait, will it ever be 13? What are we reading as our content here? So we got 9 here. 1... One. See, that doesn't... How does this ever get to nine? Uh, we'll go to twelve, and we'll just watch it. Do remember to come back and look at this. Oh, and there's a science delivery. Or just happened. So... Uh, does this means science is going again? Yeah, it's unloading. Yeah, science will once again start. All right, so things aren't that bad. Notice how I resisted looking at the moves. Not yet. I haven't earned it yet. Uh, sodium hydroxide. And wood. All right, so... What are our proportions? It's 13. What a terrible proportion. So let's say 15. They both stack to the same height. So the number is 200. So we're off to get 2,000 wood and 600 sodium hydroxide, right? Yeah. All right, so dinosaur, get out here. Not you, you're not a dinosaur. Alright, your job is to go right there. Store food. Your job is now to go up to Wood Depot right here. Till Caravan has wood in quantity 2100. And I want you to go down right here to Sodium Hydroxide Depot. And until caravan has sodium hydroxide in quantity 700. Great. I want you to come here. You're going to have to wait for our signal, which is uh, comparator equals go. And then until target. Until target. Wood. 2000. Hydroxide. Sodium hydroxide, 600. And then you do this forever, my friend. Right there. All right, so that will go get the stuff I need, right? That will put that on the board. And I guess we just do this, right? If only for aesthetics. Yeah, that looks all right. So that's where our cellulose goes. And we have to govern this, of course. Of course, I put this in the one place that doesn't have power. Great job, me. All right, so how do we govern this? Um, you should only be producing when... Um... Well, first off, when there's space to put things out. So when there's no breaks here. So that's one thing to look at. So we need a cider combinator. So we want to wire up you into you, and then you to you to you. All right, so what we want is output is going to be E equals one. And we want you to 
uh, read contents. What we are looking for is no breaks and nothing waiting. That's going to be what we're going to do. Waiting is going to be right here. All right, so I want you to enable and pulse. No, read belt contents and pulse. All right, so what we're looking for is, um, this is breaks Mach 2 less than or equal to 0. There we go. Then I want these to turn on and and uh, cellulose. Oh, this is going to read. No, we want we don't want red line here. We want green line here. Very important. Very important. And then we want only reading off the green line. Cellulose less than two. Less than three. We'll allow two to be right there. Because passing by, we don't want it to hitch, you know? Because two will come down, they'll hit here, and they'll hit here at the same time. And I want this machine to still go. So that's what it is. So we want to enable, disable, E greater than or equal to one, right there. All right, you go and you go. Um, probably need faster hands here, right? And this will only produce when all of the brakes have exited this machine and there isn't a line. And lastly, we need to do something about wastage. Oh, we have to uh, whitelist brakes. And right here we need to whitelist biocrud. Yeah. All right. So right there and right there. And you need to be whitelist cellulose. All right. Got it. So this will only get in that, and then we have our, our waste bin here that will have to be just manually cleaned out, hopefully once every five years. Um, breaks, less than equals, okay, good. Hopefully you're coming right here, right? Nice, excellent timing, my dino friend. We get to watch this go now. We'll see if this works. Good. Make it cellulose right there. Get in, get in. And this will last 10 minutes, which is more than enough time. Why aren't you going? It looks like there isn't enough uh, throughput on the wood, which is probably something I should have innately understood, right? List uh, hydroxide. This is now a state of sin. That's okay. We've been here before. Okay. Good. Good. Now what we need to do is clean the sodium hydroxide off. Great. All right, so now we have not quite two wood lines. That's enough for both of these. And we are making bricks again, so good. Now the problem is, of course, it's gonna overfill on this whenever this stagger stagnates out and everything that's in here, which will be 25 cellulose and then a bit more so we're going to make a lot of bio crud here in time. Because what's in the machine rots. We'll have to consider that in time. I think that we probably don't need to uh, be speed moduling this, huh? That's yeah, fine. Here, 
Let's see what happens if we don't. And we save power. And that's great. Power being used. That is what I want to see. So are we going to be able to keep up? I'm going to watch through one full cycle. Here at 100%, we're at 32. So let's see if it is greater or lesser with this new rate of cellulose production. Looks like we're going to be okay. It's like maybe we're not going to be okay. It's like I should have... Yeah, it's much less. Alright, so maybe we do need to speed module these. Alright, fine. We'll be back to look on this. Speaking of being back to look on, let's uh, see how Moo Gambling is doing. Oh, we still haven't got a winner yet. No. I mean, at least this is really fast. It's 15 seconds per goal. This should pop, like, today without much of a problem. And I have to set up the whole thing to make them. Come on, do it. Come on, you can do it. Just a normal move. Just normal moves. What is this that we've done? 45 rolls? Alright, that's pretty good. Alright, so. How's artillery doing? It's my other favorite spot. We appear not full up yet, but we are cranking along, making all of the, everything we need. So we're on lard right now, which is unfortunate because I really, the, the skin is better. Coming along, I guess. Here's the Skinosaur. Pity it takes so much sodium hydroxide. This is, of course, the Plot to Fight Club right here. <laughs> Which suddenly makes everything I'm doing so much more awesome. Ah, this is how we make soap, my friends. Soap gets us clean. Ah. Soap is the stuff of failures. Alright, so do we have... No, we still don't have... Dinosaurs just waiting. Oh, okay, you finally got it. Alright, this is fine. Time to go do that other thing I said I was going to do. Which was photo pour up here at... This is going to be a hard one because your toy low decays so fast. Right here. This is what I'm doing with my life. Um, this dino is trying real hard to pick up photopores. But it doesn't work like that. Speaking of not working like that, I gotta clean this sucker out. Take this, take this, take this. Take all this. As long as you're not giving away the energy drink, we'll be fine. Okay, so this, this has to be fixed. I'm not sure what to do about this. Is you need photopores in order to go, and it decays in five minutes. See, that's just not long enough, because, um... Um... The time it takes to slaughter a hundred trits and gather them all up and bring them all over is just too short. Therefore, I must move some slaughterhouses over here and process trits here, question mark, and then just gather everything together and all the other byproducts together. Um... Then make a carousel of photopores going through here somehow, and then just uh, get them out. Like, I can do this. Like, this becomes trip processing land. That's. can be done. And, you know, I'm probably gonna do it. Right now, energy drink. 
I don't really want to move trick processing though. I mean, it's going to be terrible, terrible. I've had much more difficult choices. Where are you, biomass power plants? You are right here. Fortunately, carbon dioxide is not, repeat, not my problem. My problem is I don't have any containers on me. Oh, wait a second. What did I just throw on the belt? Pay no attention to those buildings which suddenly appeared on the belt. That was, that was the energy drink talking. The energy drink makes me do strange things. I don't like it when the output, the trash, is the same as the input. It should not go into the trash then. It should go just directly into an input. I don't even, that's even, that seems like something that would be very easy to code up to. Hmm. See, like, why are we getting trash here? I don't understand. There's so much in this world I do not understand. Okay, there we go. Alright, so we've disposed of that biomass, and now what we have to do is move trip. For real, I'm gonna move trip fodder. Ah, and then have another. Well, the dinosaur, instead of, um,. Hauling uh, photopores will haul assorted meat and, and uh, so what I need is right here. We need to pick up this stuff first. And then what we have to do is establish a trit carous a photopore carousel where they will all have an opportunity to go into optical fiber, but if they rot out, nobody cares. Like, okay, that's harsh. We all care. Uh, but if they rot out, nobody dies. How about that? So we do something like this. Then just straight back, right? So we have the photopores coming round. Oh, that's super unfortunate. Especially since the photopores. Yeah, we can't use we can't do this. This is too tight. It has to come all the way around on the outside, so this design is gonna look brilliant in a moment. All right, photopore carousel right here. Wasn't I out of aramid fiber for some reason too? And that was because oh, terra 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 oil chloride, and that's that has to be just completely moved. So I guess that's coming right. So here we go, one thing at a time. So the photopores will come in right here. And this depot just doesn't exist anymore. Right? And then in and out. Got it. So, this way. And our job is now there. So, great. Right? So we have a carousel. And now it's time to go kidnap some dinosaurs and then brainwash them. So you've stopped. Okay, good. Why have you stopped? What decision? It has too much cellulose inside. Problem is this cellulose is all going to rob out. There's six on the belt. Huh. Yeah, this is gonna fill up. This is needs to get piped to uh central biomass disposal. Oh, what are you doing, friend? 
Are you spinning? Are you one of the stuck? I need more caravans. Here. Go. Go on a nice round. Oh, this is nice. Good to have them again. So time to grab a few more caravans. Not upgrade caravans. Not yet anyway. And then I have to free a couple others. Down here in the laughter factories. Um, yeah, Tritz, unfortunately. <laughs> I've gone too far. You are going to have to be reprogrammed. But you'll go brainless in a second here. Because I'm about to rip up uh, Trit processing. And right here. Like right here is where he's coming with those trits. And I just picked it up and it doesn't exist anymore. So these things are so huge. This is unfortunate. I'm probably gonna only be able to put eight of them in. So this leaves us room to process more things. Oh, and this doesn't have to exist anymore either. We'll have to account for this as well. And then this space just comes back to me, which is nice. And this is Photopor. Nope, nope, dude, 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 dude. Come here. Um, this guy was supposed to get everything here and then dump this here, I think. Wait a second, what is this? What did I just do? Was that composting photopores to biomass and then he was picking up photopores? I was picking up the biomass? So you are the one. No, you're your shell guy. Oh, this is photopore out right here. So this is now not happening anymore. Okay, so that was extra biomass out guy. And he didn't really have to be here, but he was. We're reclaiming a lot of space. I mean, we're going to use most of it later. And then you are trying to get photopores, and you are going to upcode it right there. Only, um, you are no longer doing that. And I have to get rid of all of this. Great. Time to do some, do this again, right? Uh, give me my biomass, my boxes, my energy drink, let's go get some more of this, like this just it's picked up, and you get picked up, alright, let's go get some steel, on energy drink, I am the steel, so up here, kind of up here, Then make me boxes, please. Then I need hands, unfortunately. I underestimated, miscalculated, erred, fumbled. All right, good. Now let's go get rid of all this biomass and bio crud. Yep. And it should be pretty trivial to redirect trits to where they need to go. And then I have to get the bloodline into the rest of the bloodline. That's going to be a little less trivial, but it'll happen. It'll be okay. I must assure everyone, no one is in any danger at all. We shall all be just fine. And this is nice to see. All right, so now I just got to get rid of the biomass. This is so nice. It would have been so much nicer if I would have set the factory up so this was uh, not so incredibly awkward, but it's okay. And you too. There you go. Down we go. Um, and then 
back to pick up all of our stuff, and then onward to glory. That, those are shells. Where did I leave all my stuff? Where's my, where's my car? Okay. Now we're just going to leave this for probably even greater moo processing later. Maybe. So what we need now is to drag this all the way over. We must fix the problem we had solved before the update. It's okay. We're not bitter. Nah, not at all. Alright, so the world we live in is this. This area is now a slaughterhouse. Need to figure out the menacing German way to uh, pronounce that. So what we want right now is... Now we'll be able to fit this in just fine. Two, three. There we go. Thank you. One, two, three, four. This is what we do with our life. There. There. And so our friends, the Trits, will probably come up from down here. It's like so. And then the products of the Trits will come up like so. Should probably align this with the top. Oh, power's almost out. I gotta do something about that immediately after this. Probably right now, actually. Um, because I'm kind of close. I'm thinking about it. So let's go swap out the canisters. So nice that I actually made a depot for this. Pity I don't really remember to do it. Alright, so into the suit. Yep, aware. And chuck all you guys in. Pick up all these. There we go. And then put the rest of the back. There. We will start charging now. It is not onerous, but at the same time, it's not fun. Okay, my friends, you are, what are Arthurians for? They're good for brains, huh? Hmm. They breed strangely, I think. And like, Corlaxes are pretty good. Moos are better for lard. Hmm. Corlaxes are better for skin. We better just stick with moos, right? Trits are great for lard. Anyway, this is what we're doing. Blood on the outside. Now, blood. Blood in the middle. Okay, good. Um, now we need the trit in. Trit in. Trit in. Trit in. You know. Trit in. Trit in. Trit in. And then we need products out, products out, products out. And then, of course, products out, products out, products out. So right there is good. Um, guests of honor are trit. And they will come from right here. They don't require any cages. All right, so Mr. Dinosaur, Mr. Tritosaur, actually. You need to just have a slight attitude adjustment. All right, so then you go here, no. Instead, you go here. And then you empty your arrow. Which I just kind of want you to do right now. 
How are trits doing? They're being made, right? We had a wastewater crisis before. They're being made, being made, being made. All right, wastewater crisis is probably resolved. I'm gonna clip that until I'm ready for it. Now we have two worlds, right? Two worlds. So I want output priority to the right, photo pour. You come this way, but there is a chance this will overflow. So everything else comes out this way. And if it overflows, output priority to the right, right? But if it overflows straight back in. So this looks right, right? I mean, it kind of looks neat. So, all right, so, well, no. If it's overflowing, then they'll just decay, right? So, oh, I don't have room for more than one filter. That sucks. Because again, there's a slight, slight chance it'll decay into uh, bio crud on this line. You know? How do I account for that? And I don't have another filter right here. I could make a red one. Could make a red one. My first red belt item. Oh, and it still only doesn't have what. Ah, it still doesn't have what I want. Here we go. First red belt right there. Um, do I feel good about myself? No. No, I don't. I really don't. Um, so there's going to be, we're going to be throwing off bio crud here. Like consistently. Definitely want all photo pores to go to the right. We also want all bio crud to be going to the right, I guess. And it doesn't seem like we have enough room. Sure, we'll keep that. Should really institute red belts soon, right? Oh, this is everything looks bad. Um, but we also have bio crud, so I guess output priority to the right. But so much decays in the crud, right? No, it decays into jerky. Lard goes into crud, so there's no harm if crud goes that way. We have to have to crud filter anyway. Oh, that's what we'll do. Um, output priority to the left. Filter photo pour. Photo pours go for another round. Bio crud, which is the rotty product, comes out right here. All right, so we will now have uh, a bio crud line here that accounts for the total uh, galaxy of everything that can happen, including lard. So that will come out here. We will worry about programming this in a moment. Right there. And then a dinosaur will carry that out to some area where it will get dunked in a processing unit, right? I'm not going to stress terribly much about what that's going to look like right this second. Right now it's enough to put it in a box. It's sort of aesthetic, right? Except for the fact there is no power still. Um, there. Uh, 
power in ready. And we'll also bring over here as we make network, make a web, not just streets. Okay. This is probably not what I want to do, right? Because it means I can never walk between them. All right, so let's back out of that plan. I like walking between things, especially when I'm out of my mind on energy drink, so let's just give future me a break. Find a way to get rid of all this blood. You know, just one of those tests. Serial killer or factorio player? Has a lot of blood. Has to get rid of the blood. Never gonna get any aramid fiber, so. Wait a second, this will be continually making it and continually. Oh, this is not right. I'm gonna have to fix this next because it's gonna be continually crudding everything up because the cellulose will just keep going as it rots out. There's no. Uh, it needs another test here for diversity of products in there, which uh, I will handle. Where is the closest bloodline? It's probably nowhere close, right? Diesel. Like, absolutely, positively nowhere close. Arthropod bloodline. Oh, here's a bloodline. Not sure this is the correct place to put the blood. This is processing. This is blood out. So I don't know. Blood, blood. Ah, let's make albumin. So if I can get to right here, head south, it'll be all right. So just head south, I guess. All right. That I think is probably a plan. All right, so let's find a way to dispose of our spare blood. You know, that blood we're not using right now, find a place for it. Hopefully that's a good line. All right, so is that gonna be a good line? No, it looks like it's exactly on the walkway. It looks like a terrible line. <laughs> and I'm a terrible person for suggesting it. How about right here. I mean, maybe. Let's take a look. This looks pretty ideal as far as spacing. And, oh, that's nice. Okay. Let's see if this works out. Okay. Good. Oh, we're going to run out of pipe. This is unfortunate, but we can deal with it. Now I have crushed quartz in my inventory. Why would I ever want crushed quartz in my inventory? It goes over here somewhere. Where is it? There. Take some crushed quartz. You take some crushed quartz too. All right. So where are we? We want to go over by albumin. So this isn't going to be that hard at all. May even have exactly as much pipe as I need. Then, right about here, right? Actually, puffle over and try to figure it out. So, right there is bad, but right here is good. Can we do this? Can. Oh. And so, what we're going to be doing here is. Pumping this way. We are exactly at the fullest extent. Alright. Great. Fantabulous. And the blood comes over here. The blood flows anew. Alright, so. That should hook that all back up. There is no telling whether or not this blood is in the correct area. But it goes by albumin. So again, this is probably bad. Um, because we have 
producers and consumers all in the same area. All right, let's go. Let's turn this on. There we go. It's time to render out some tricks. And we're not quite finished because this has to go over there. Let's go check on gambling. How are we doing on gambling for moves? Oh, we haven't won yet. Ah. Oh. We just got these garbage moves. We gonna do it? Are we gonna see it? Is this the moment? Are we ready? Oh, again, fail moo. Pity moo, you know? Two moos enter, maybe one moo leaves. We don't know what happens. <laughs> we, we have absolutely no idea what goes on in there. We are burning moos at, we're not even getting a body back, which is concerning. When you get right down to it, where are these, where are these moves going? Ah, oh. all right. Anyway, Photopore is coming in. We have our first arrivals. They all burst it at once, right? Maybe I want fewer of them, fewer throughput. You know, just one at a time going. So we're just going to have a little burst right here of these. There's another burst coming. Hmm. How many of these are you going to pick up? Probably going to pick up three. That's enough, right? Let's watch. All right. One, two, three. That's what I thought. One, two, three. And then you'll get one, two. Okay, we'll put in faster hands here. So we're making optical cable again, but it's not consistent. Hmm. Two, three. And it grabbed a fourth. That's interesting. Then we have that clog, unfortunately. That one got three that time, so that's good. And another wave's coming. And we'll be out of trits. All right, so let's take a look at trit production. Trit, trit production, the last. Trit production's kind of high, honestly. It's uh, averaging like two a minute. That's pretty good. Bloodline getting sorted. Now we have just a sorted produce line. And I can't say fill cargo because like the brains are gonna be um the, the definition of filled cargo is just kind of weird. Um so what is actually my option here? If I can't fill cargo. I want to get, oh, empty that. Okay, I can just empty that then. All right, that's the way to do it. And then we have to put a receiver in. Uh, and the receiver, why don't we just put generic, just piles of meat? We want. I don't want to bring it back down on the, all the way down by the laughter factories. Why was rubber stopped? Uh, aromatics. All right, we st we never did that. We researched that tech and we never got off the shrooms. So maybe I go do that next. I set up a facility for artificial aromatic production. Take pressure off of uh, a lot of stuff. So I guess We have the meat line right here. We kind of want to get in on the meat line right here, I suppose. And right here would be kind of tidy. That is doing something. Oh, that's powering this. And that's all. So we can do better, right? Maybe. If I want to move this nub. 
Did anyone else use water around here? I don't know. Like, right here would be a good place to put one. So maybe I can do this. It's rock food out of the way. Full extent it is. This is just where we go when we want to put meat in. It's the meat in. This doesn't go very well, unfortunately. Dude, you can figure this one out. This mystery is solvable, even by you. I don't want to use, uh, don't want to touch that even. I don't want to use fast hands because it will clog the belt. So it's slow hands it is. Um, I guess this is going to be a dinosaur. It's just working a lot. Some my inventory. It might go here, jerky. Jerky will float all the way to the end, right? Jerky doesn't go here. Jerky, jerky, jerky. Jerky ends up down there. And I guess bio crud will end up down there too. Which is a shame because we're going to be making a lot of it. So maybe I have to make a special bio crud box or flush area. It's going to have to happen. Um, all right, so dinosaur on the field. Uh, you're going to south, which is appropriate. Then we want to go over to the new trich processing area, which is right there. I want you to come right here and then until target has, wait, I can't fill cargo. I can't. I need empty target is what I need. Uh, I guess we have to do this, right? So it's going to be meat and brain and lard bones Skin. What else? Target has zero, 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 zero. What else is a trip made of? Um, guts. Made of guts. Don't you walk away from me. Until target has guts. Zero. So pulls everything into this inventory. And it comes here, and I want you to empty that cargo. I want you to do this forever. All right, I think that's what I need to do, right? And then the problem is, you know, we have the, the junk bin at the end, and this is, is going to be a problem. Not might be, is going to be. And I guess I have to... Bio, bio crud, bio crud can be composted, right? Yeah, it takes four bio crud. Mm. All right, so we can do this, right? Just feed it into this line, right? Another composter, please. Um, recycle. Completely obscuring this, unfortunately. <laughs> um, I want you to be bio crud. Need a crud example to rub in its face. Um, I wish I could set it. Um, 
and so you are going to be outputting biomass. I think this is going to work. I'm not totally sure this is going to work. If it does not work, I will come and fix it. There. You guys need to please get rid of that. And this doesn't have to exist anymore. Great. All right, so what I have to do is now just dump all of the waste onto this line. And it will come up here. Wait a second, where's this going? This is... This is excess lard line right here. So I guess, yes, that's also what goes up and on over here. Only it's, um, I guess we have to do one of these. Still doing this whitelist lard. I don't really believe in this at all. Like not even a little bit. I think what I'm doing right now is silly. And I'm definitely, definitely going to have to come back and address this at some point in time. Alright, so... Fantastic though, right? Things are okay? Maybe? I don't know. Um, we're definitely processing augs here. Let's take a bit of this up and get rid of this jerky. We have a jerky processor here. Take advantage of it. Jerky. There you go. And then all of that is on its way. Oh. Well, the other thing I need to do is this. Okay. Maybe this is okay. Maybe this is a huge disaster. And almost let some skin through. Oh wow, that's just a ton of lard. Why? Uh, because it was picking lard. Alright, that's acceptable, I suppose. Um, I suppose we want input priority from this side, because this can wait. So that was a whole blast of lard. But luckily it got completely picked up. <laughs> so much so that we actually have backup here. It's nice to see. Okay. So let's go relook re at all everything. So we're making trits. Trits are powering along. I've never seen all trits going. That's fine. Wastewater problem has solved itself. That's great. All I had to do is leave that alone. And we have a bunch of trits right here. Probably had a whole other delivery, right? To the new trit processing area, which is right over in this area right here. Ah, so yes, more trits were did arrive. The photopores are I'm not seeing any biocred here yet, which is intriguing. This guy's gonna eat a lot of food, because there's no govern governor, you know? I suppose I could make it so that it waits until there's at least 500 meat and then goes. It looks like this carousel is in fact uh, picking up all of the um, all of the photopores. That one got grabbed and that was like a second time around, maybe even a third time around. You be prodded? Ooh, you should probably be prodded. Maybe not, given that it works with time sensitive. Maybe I should put more than one arm on there. That sounds like a good first step, right? Yeah, so here's some second rounders. You can tell because they're almost they're halfway dead. But they're not gonna escape this time. Yeah, now they immediately get used. So so long as everything like this stays like this, and like we don't have a plastic problem, 
Oh, but what's going to happen is that uh, eventually this is going to fill up, and then all the photo pores will be wasted. They will all go to crud, and then they will come back here, and there's just nothing that can be done about them. So they will end up down there. Oh, and it's, the dinosaur is not scheduled to pick up crud. So what we're going to do here is we're going to add uh, circuit, no, circuit condition? No. Uh, until target has bio crud. Quantity zero. Forgot about you, right? Oh, and then I got rid of this? That was trash of me. Uh, right there. Then empty cargo. I guess I just let you cycle. I was going to burn more food than is really necessary. Waste baskets are not filling up very fast, which is what I had hoped. Um, all right, so I think we did some good, right? I think this is working okay. Now it's producing photophores less and less because of uh, less coverage right here, which means optical cape, optical fiber is kind of bursty in how it gets made. It's like they can survive two trips around, maybe three. I don't know how to read that. That guy immediately got used. So we're not wasting any photopores right now. Things should be fine, question mark. So let's go take a look at our advanced machine parts. See how things are going. Oh yeah, we had to fix this again because we're making a lot of crud. We have to govern that better. And we have to look in on gambling. How we doing? How we doing? Did we win? No. Didn't win even once. Oh. Uh, out of 136 chances, no winners. Ooh. I have to say, I might have to complain to management. So what I'm looking for now. Okay, we're just pass by Bakelite over in the area. Yeah, it's being made again. So good. This guy will get filled up again. The phenol was a problem. Phenol probably still is a problem. But it's not an absolute emergency right now. Alright, so right now we're just destroying uh, cellulose. What we need to do is that thing. Um, we need first a decider, and then an arithmetic. This is what it used to be, right? So what we want, what are our signals? I guess we want to read green. We have nothing do everything we output everything one everything greater than zero so let's toss in some stuff right there we go now we should get yeah, we should probably hook this up right now we're getting all that. Now we want to sum everything. Uh, each plus output equals total. Total. Four. And so we want to take our green here. Right there. Do we start a cycle? No. And what we want here. You now total is zero. And we want total to be... One, two, three, four, five. So greater than four. And total greater than four. Then you can go. This is going to rot out. You know, let's just simulate the rotting out. 
and you still can't go because you're not enabled not enabled because the rest of the stuff is here okay so this will help okay hopefully help um all right so good Let's take a look at artillery shells why we get up in the morning right looks like we're not making a huge amount of progress it's like a whole bunch of uh, dinosaurs came and raided so if I am gonna push out tomorrow it's not gonna be pushing out very far let's go take a look definitely have to up move production there's nothing for it so next episode next I mean it's really just take a chunk right so like wipe out all these guys plant an embassy right here i guess moving forward just straight forward is how to do it um yeah just take this area take put an embassy there put an embassy there hope i can destroy everything in here efficiently push there have nice walkways everywhere yeah soon um What's our problem here? What are you stuck on? No, oh, you need stainless. How do we get into a world where we don't have stainless anymore? No aramid fiber. All right, so I guess that's what we have to do next, right? Um, aramid fiber is because you toy allo uh, rots immediately, just straight up immediately. We should be going full blast right now. So let's go take a look at the uh, artillery, the explosives factory, and see. No, oh, I was almost there. And then I turned wreck. All right, here we are. We still can't get enough glycerol. Here, let's take a look. Explosives. Oh, I don't like this at all. I don't like these dips to zero. This is when I don't have any moves. Or we're waiting for another delivery. The two are probably equivalent though, right? So, okay, look again. Look at moves being processed. Moves being processed, very happy. Look at trits being contributed. Crits, giving it their all down here. All right, so we're making very few things. The photopores are coming in, and this is backing up now, so that's good. And this is accumulating, and that guy's just walking back and forth, shuttling it from place to place. I could have just built a belt, I suppose. Um, honestly, that might have been a better choice. So belt from here down to here. I've done worse things. Anyway, that's not what I was looking for. Checking on gambling, of course. Hey, hey, we got one. We got one. Yeah, we got one. And then next episode, we need two of these and we have to breed them up. Let's not think too hard about that, right? because this guy is almost with another delivery we'll have to add more muck move processing and that's gonna put more stress on the, the lines um why is this stopped it isn't so just gotten a delivery of probably seeds looks like we actually do need to increase seed production and or seed transport because we're just cranking on seed yeah these guys can't shuck any more flowers these guys can't we need more seed transport hmm we need this line right here to join up with this line right here and then come down to here. Yeah, let's just go do that. Um, it's not going to be pretty. But 
it's in the service of the factory. And if we're going to start making even more moves, um, we need this to be on point, right? I mean, it's going to be a shame if I breed up the next generation moves and uh, can't use them because I don't have the logistics to get everything in. You go right here. And what we need from you is not right there. Right there. Like that. That's fine. Get down. And this is, this looks dumb. And it looks dumb for a very good reason. This, this is dumb. However, uh, it's dumb with a purpose. How about that? There we go. And now we should be using all parts of our brain, right? This fine fellow needs to fill up. We'll fill up all the faster. So there will be space for more moo calves and space for more moos. Okay, I want you to output priority to right there. So you are only overflowing. Oh, and this isn't even hooked up. I need you to, again, output priority to the right. And right here, yeah, exactly right. Input priority from that side, output priority to that side. Oh, and you can't even prod this or anything. That sucks. Well, the good news is we are now producing more flowers. We'll probably see this on the graph, right? Seeds. Elysia seeds. Yeah. <laughs> okay, a massive bump here. Massive. From... 1.3 to almost 1.7. Wow, right? Wow. I suppose I could um, put a beacon here. Beacon all these guys to move at like 1.3 speed, 1.5 speed, something like that. This is going to have uh, kinda like feedback. See, like, nothing's coming out here, because it, it shouldn't. It shouldn't ever back up to here, because these don't have enough to fill a belt. Um, oh, this is another interesting question about logistics here of keeping this all going. Yeah. Yeah, we'll see. So, I made a change. Things are moving a little more efficiently just a little and we'll see if this turns out to be a good thing or bad thing in the end this guy's almost here Florine, Fi Fiorino Fiorino is going to be here he's passing by the um, Ulrichs how are we doing on Queens? 33 Queens? that's probably good right? Um, and will you have enough by the time he's here? it doesn't look like it needs to get down to here, right? And, yeah, he's almost here. He is imminent. His arrival shall... Almost here? Almost here? Where is he? Fiorino. Oh, he's still struggling his way through the... Ah, uh, through the bees. There he is. And so, no, not near enough. We're like 400 short. Bang. And you need to get 22... Oh, we're quite short. Well, I'll keep monitoring it, right? We're eating all of those flowers now in service of seeds. I wonder if that's true everywhere. Mm. I need even more Relisia flowers. They all have to go into moose. Moose are so expensive. Okay, he got what he needed and he left. Alright, so if I go and look again, 
Let's see how moves are doing. If delivery happens, feeds being distributed. Yeah, even if I do put the next gen moves in, um, I have very strong concerns on whether or not uh, I will be able to keep all of them fed with just the speeds of my belts and the amount of religia seeds they eat. It's just absurd. 30 religia seeds, 15 religia seeds. Yeah, I don't think I have the just the materials to keep all this going if calves are no longer the bottleneck. But, you know, might as well make it so calves are no longer the bottleneck. All right, so what am I doing now? Um, we solved a few problems. Oh, perifethanol chloride is definitely the next thing. Um, to make aramid fiber. So it's going to have to be barreled over, unfortunately. There's no other way. Um, because I, I mean, I could make a pipeline all the way down. I don't really want to do that. I'm going to make aramid fiber. This is too far. Aramid fiber is made right up here, further north. Okay, good. That's probably just fine. Don't pay any attention to it. Oh, and the other thing is the aromatics. Maybe I should do the aromatics right now and then do this tomorrow or the next cycle. I think that's what I want to do. I may have to move this guy. Ah. Alright, so we're doing this later. We're going to deal with um, uh, aromatics again. So once again, it's being used and consumed in pretty much the same quantities. And that's bad. So what we want to do is set up an alternate slash additional system to the mushroom and we have the tech for it we researched it that was tech tech is weebling around yeah now we're missing logi science for real logi science is the bottleneck do not believe hard doubt missing animal sample I can kind of believe that got clogged. So, all right. No longer heart doubt that much. We need meat, and we don't have any meat in. That seems like a very weird place to be. Huh? Where's the meat going? Into aging, in order to make jerky, in order to make Corlex food. So, do I really believe in this? I'm going to watch this, though. It's important that nothing escapes. Yeah, nothing escapes. Yeah, that's a trit arrival right there if I ever saw one. This is nice. This is what you want out of life. And then there's a big... A uh, pile of meat. How much meat do you need? Um. So I guess it's just really pulsy now because of. Uh, oh no, it shouldn't be because we should be getting a base load of meat out of this, and it appears we're not because no. Oh. Well, dude, that shouldn't be. All right, we can fix that. That is definitely a problem. That is definitely my fault. Like, as opposed to all those other problems, which are absolutely not my fault. They were other people's faults. I had nothing to do with any of those things. All right, so this is, and you also need to take biomass. Alright, so that explains why we were low on meat. Ok, 
because there was a problem. Now this will start moving again. I wonder why. It's, okay, I shouldn't wonder these things. I shouldn't ask these questions. It just was a thing that happened, right? The question is, do we have any Ulrichs? We've been pr processing Ulrichs forever, and I don't see any. Our Ulrichs out. Ooh. You are out of Elysia Seeds. What are you doing? What are you trying to do here? You're trying to get Ulrich food. And the pony food needs flora, and the flora doesn't exist. Alright, so this is kind of a multi-dimensional crisis, eh? And the pony food from the pony food maker, which is, it's got to be right in here, right? Because all my weird food makers are right here. Ah, right here. And right here, this is, this is the problem. The biomass right here, which I need to get rid of somehow. You don't need any of this stuff. You're doing just fine. There's no need to question this at all. You're going at full speed. All is well. Um, yeah, so right here, this line is not properly venting. And to vent this, it has to come all the way back to here. So we just thread it along this line, I guess. Ah, sure, whatever. We'll do that. Uh, this is what it's for, right? And we will do this. We want you to use filters and flora, spolinin, and also biomass. Great. Pick up all that. Pick up all that. Now I have access to the stress slots. New. So, how to do this? Because this is not gonna want to go, huh? It doesn't need any of this because it's so we're gonna go on a nice little adventure here down this way and this is our outline the line what is out pick up all this stuff Try to get rid of it. Yeah, the logistics of this are all messed up. I don't know what to do about that. Alright, so, are you actually going? Yes. You're all actually making logs. Making tons and tons of logs. Processing those augs, yes. Being processed into everything that an aug is deep down in its soul. Burn all that, please. Burn all this, please. Thank you. Alright, so now, back to the task at hand. We are... Burrowing our way back to making pony food so that we can have ponies again. So that we can then uh, transform them into higher level ponies, is how I'm going to put it. <laughs> as an optimistic way to putting it, I suppose. They are a different form. Planar advancement. Alright, so let's look around. Um, look at the thing we did again. Um, which was, again, right here, right there. 
We are still making optical cable. We have a backlog now. We're making a lot of trits, a lot of trit parts. I really should have just built a belt. Just belted from there to there. Maybe I'll go fix that later. Are we done yet? No, we're not even done yet. All right, let's go look at Moose. You know we're ultra gamble winners. We should probably prepare for winning more, right? Um, because I could keep this going until I have like four and just settle at that. I'm not going to need it. Well, I'll need eight if I put the new reproductive centers in. Um, so no. You know, we should prepare for victory. Maybe that's the next thing we do instead of aerial caravans. Make Xeno cells. Because next level muck moves can't be bred. They have to be assembled. Oh, I have to grab animal sample. That sucks. Um. Yeah, that really sucks, actually. They can the plasmids. Xenogenic cells are the stuff I'm gonna have to make. Um. It's just plasmids and bone meal growth factor. I mean, is this my only my only shot at this? Xenogenic. Do using this. And we do it with bones and oxygen, bone meal, skin, chitin, guts. Lard is bad. Meat is bad. Brains are surprisingly bad. So bones? Bone meal is the best. And skin, but I'm not going to use skin. Skin's called for. Chitin, maybe. Hmm. And then sugar and retrovirus and xenogenic cells will make stem cells at a rate of three to one, one to three. And then I can assemble them. So I can assemble skin into basically. Oh, that's nice. So this is basically what you want to do. You want to take your skin, and then it becomes... Oh, you're going to need more than that. Take your entire animal, and then make it into more brains. So, it's kind of like... Um, what you really want to do is you want to convert all of the animal parts into uh, cells as just intermediate stage. Just holding it. At least all your overflows. Okay, we good. We making pony food again? Good. And you, of course, you don't have outs. You can linen and biomass. So we need whitelist, linen, whitelist, biomass. It's not that hard now that it's second nature to do this. Where's the other outputs? Need only Ulrich food. I don't want to say this is a particularly fun design, you know? Alright, so there you're getting your pony food. And you'll take it down to make ponies. And the pony none of the ponies end up in good places. It's just just it doesn't work like that. How are we doing down here? We have all of rock food we need. Oh, we're limited on tree sap of all things. Maybe I'll fix this and this will be the last thing I fix. Oh, rubber is just raining down. Why don't we have a lot of sap? Where do we get our sap from? I thought we had it like right here, right? Yeah. Oh, we're using bad sap trees. We don't have a lot of them. All right, let's go add some more sap stuff. And then we'll probably be done, right? Um. Oh yeah, definitely done. Uh, it is time. So I put 
all of my sap tree stuff over here. And we can even level this up to the next one, right? Let's grab a couple blocks for you. And don't I even have... These are sap trees. I thought I had a bin with... Uh... Uh, sap extractors. No? No? Guess not. Let's make like 10 of you. Sap. For that I need just dirt. Dirt and air core inductors. Alright, fine. I will go handle this thing. And then we will go install that. Two, three, four, five. Then we'll look around once again. And then that'll be it. Then next episode, we'll try to do more. Sap, sap trees. It's three. There we go. It's everything we need. So let's now go and try to figure out why we don't have enough sap on this line. Here, right here. This is such an old piece of infrastructure. This is an extremely old piece of infrastructure. Alright, so, first off. I... Really? Really? I, I kind of disagree with this. The uh, the ability of doing this. Didn't I have a whole bunch of staff extractors at one point? Sap extractor Mach One Legacy. And I guess now I can't put them in. I need staff extractor. What what is this? What is this? You can't do this. This is this is not legal. And what do I have on me right now? Sap extractor Mach One. Oh, this is the thing. The thing happened. Wait, this one has uh, loaders on it now. So is this the same thing? I read that this was happening, and then it didn't happen, so... I was like, why? See, yeah, casting unit is also the legacy version. So, alright. You know, let's take a look. Sap extractor. Is there a recipe for the legacy ones? No. Of course not. All right, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and I have to rip all these guys up because all these guys are just gonna get in my way. None of this works out. It's all a bad plan. Every bit about it, bad plan. Okay, so, now, as I was saying, this guy, we have to leave a space, or else we're just barbarians, right? Okay, copy, 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 copy. Okay, so this is a little better than it was before, but not a lot. And we have to do something about this. Um, I guess what we do is just this, right? Just accept there isn't one right there. <laughs> okay. This is all proper sap extractors. 
and figure it out. And this is probably doubling what we had before. Which is not quite good enough. And we actually have... Oh wait, when I pick them up... Oh. Oh, okay. So this is Staff Extractor Legacy. But, but, but... It becomes a Staff Extractor. Okay. So I don't have to actually rebuild them. That's good. If I pick them up, they get immediately converted in my inventory. That's nice. Thank you, Melon. Just like that. So we're actually going to make progress here. Even though it doesn't feel like we ever make any progress on anything. We're ever spinning our wheels. Okay. Now. Oh, you need power. There you go. I wonder what prompted this change. Because, like, it's... It's not unwelcome, certainly. It just seems... It also didn't seem forced by anything, you know? So what caused this to be? Yeah, I'm sure there's an answer. and not sure I want to know it. I think maybe the mystery is more satisfying. Alright, so I'm completely out of underground pipe. I have in my inventory how many staff extractors? Staff, staff extractor. Okay, so none actually. So what I did is I upgrade every one of these here to using uh, sap trees, and then I added more. So, potential quadrupling of production here, I want to say. Potential. Alright, let's go put back these sap trees. And then... Probably call it a day. This seems like a pretty good episode altogether. Accomplish some stuff. Do not feel I've completely embarrassed myself. Sap trees, sap trees, fail trees. Yeah, those need to be composted, but, you know, I haven't got around to it yet. All right, so we did that so that the cocoon makers could have an appropriate, have more sap. And it's going to take a while for this to get down here. The aug food maker is having trouble. Because apparently there is a uh, biomass right there. Exactly right there, stopping it. Well, that's no good. We're not going to wait for that. Weird. I wouldn't have thought this would be a possibility, you know? Are you stuck? What is your job? You are a partial dinosaur. You kind of worry me. Um, everyone, everyone comes here. How is Snack Bar North doing? That's probably a pretty important question to ask. Ah, good. Attendant on hand. Food flowing. Everything's great. All right, so we've got to prepare for this. It's probably not going to help us. Ah, just one super mill. Oh, don't, don't X him. Don't, don't. Only one super mill. But soon there will be more. And then we'll have to clone him. That's, that's literally what I have to do. Clone him. Alright, so over here, over here. It looks like things are okay, right? Oh yeah, we just had a huge delivery. This guy was probably stuffing him in. Okay, so we're, we're definitely producing moose at a great rate than we are consuming moose. Um, which says I have to speed these things up. Just 
Oh, I can put efficiency modules here? I didn't know. I'm sure that really changes things. It's 10% more of everything, but... There's so much material produced as is. That's the thing. I didn't know you could prod this. Because I'm going to have to stretch it out more if I have more move production. And then I'm probably going to have to put in red belt. Well, maybe without the trits here. How's these appears doing? Gives appear eggs here. Not really enough. But over here at the Zapir pool. Yeah, they're being accumulated slowly. It's fine. Um, yeah, let's take a look one more time at everything, and then let's wrap. We are just making tons and tons of moves. We're, we're, the more move program is going. I'm really tempted just to leave it like this. I only need eight. <laughs> just staff it up with eight of these, you know? Just... Do it exactly like that. Um, science is wiggling along. Still animals, uh, animal sample bound, which is simply incorrect. But there's not a lot I can do about that right now. Oh, something's different. Oh, it's making a lot of animal sample because we had a meat delivery probably from the uh, trits arriving, the trit dinosaur arriving. I'm going to need even more of this in order to uh, breed up extra moves. And it expires. How long does this expire? One hour? Yeah, I don't know, guys. Oh, and that brain is going to expire right there. Is it here? I want you to take decay priority decayed first. All you have to do that. Don't waste. Take decayed first. But it only works when it's taking from an inventory. So, like this little one on the edge of the belt will always run off. That's profoundly unsatisfying. Yeah, that's really unsatisfying. I wish at least it would take a random one, but it always appears to take the one farthest away. So again, there is no escaping decay. It just always exists. Decay is, was, and shall be. Uh, looks like we are now guts bound. Yeah. Now we need more guts, I guess. And guts are shared, I think. Yeah, I'm just watching the factory at this point and semi-recapping. And then all of this comes up to the glycerol maker. Glycerol maker is need skin. That guy's coming. He's about to be here. And then... This is just going. Are all you taking decayed first? Yeah. Seems to clear it out regardless, but at the same time, it's not play around, right? This is still going just fine. Bonus productivity about to hit. Bam. And then, of course, explosives happen. Explosives. Nice rain of explosives right here. And... Yeah, it looks like we're stockpiling shells again. Not a lot, but we are. So I guess I can have another party next episode. Push out once or twice. And then come back and... I'll probably have all the moves I need back after that. Just gonna leave it for right now. I think I'm probably not gonna breed them up. I'm just gonna go until I have eight and then stop it. Um, because I'm not gonna need any more of them for a long time. 
I'll go the lazy way, I guess. Surprising absolutely no one. So one more episode, and then I'd have a, I'd be ready for a party. But that's not how it's going. So maybe I need to put in even more sap, I guess. I don't know if enough is penetrating. Like, yeah, now this is all just immediately consumed, and then it has to wait. I wonder if it was like this before, you know? Before the big disaster of a factory. So I might need even more sap. Alright, it's time to wrap up. Um, let's look over everything. Everything looks fine, right? There are no problems here at the factory. So we're settling into our new rhythm. The rhythm is, of course, a three-part dance. Uh, you do a military day. You do a building new things in the factory day. You do fixing things that are broken day. And so today was fix things that are broken. And I fixed um, photopores is the big thing for optical cable. And I did that by relocating trip. Uh, processing down here. Trits are going again because of the wastewater processing we put in again. Um, what else did I fix? I feel there has to be other things I did today. I can't even remember. Oh, we fixed uh, Mach 2 brake production uh, because it was dependent on cellulose, which obviously can't be transported like we, uh, we used to transport it, so I fixed that. Fix the brakes, fix the, f the optical cable for the photopores. What else? I'm not sure. Oh, we put in a, a level 2 Moo generator right here. Um, which isn't, I don't think is strictly needed. Um, especially since we seem to have a Moo bottleneck. I'm going to have to do something down here to process the Moos faster. Like either speed module those things, add more laughter factories add more laughter factories and prod them. Um, this will just produce more lard and produce more uh, skin, which will produce more artillery shells, which will make for a tighter loop, because I don't think right now the loop is quite tight enough. I think I have enough shells to take two new areas, maybe. But that might even be um, optimistic. Like if I'm really conservative with shell use, two more areas, or else uh, it's going to be a real short military day, I think. That's fine. We're in the rhythm now. Uh, and again, the goal is to clear out all this area. And this is going to be the site of the factory yet to come right in here. Pave all or all of this. Just the factory, will, the, the ultimate factory, the true factory, the factory that we have dreamed of all these years shall be here. Now build a big highway up. Now I'm only to run stimmed along like an absolute psychotic maniac. It's going to be great. As of right now, uh, I did do good. It's been a pretty good day. Factory came together. And we're actually making forward progress. So that's all for me today. Bye-bye now. Bye-bye. Bye-bye now. Bye-bye.